Hello everyone, there's another Acme video. This time I'm going to show something that I've been experimenting with, which is to use Twitter with Acme. So here I have a timeline that I've output from a tool that I've written. The link will be at the bottom of this video if you're interested. But here I'll demonstrate some of the workflows. So this tool goes and is able to download my timeline from Twitter. Each of these sections here is a different tweet that I can read. I can scroll. If I start up high here, I can highlight one of these lines. I can right click to sort of go tweet by tweet, keep track of where I am until I get to the bottom. Um, there are hyperlinks here that I can right click on to open the tweet back in the, in the web browser. There's a link that's in one of these tweets as well. I can right click on that and have a look at the link. Oh, there's an example. So there's a way to get back. So the usual Acme commands can run in here. I can do searches. I can uh, edit any of these tweets. I can type in different text. You can see the date. Um, in these round brackets, I have these commands that I can run. These are other related commands as part of the tool set. So for example, if I want to retweet this, I could uh, double click on the round bracket and then middle click to run this command and this retweets this tweet. Same with favorites. Um, same with reply, although with reply you probably want to type in your reply here whatever the reply happens to be, and the same kind of thing. You can double click and then middle click to run the reply. So the basic functionality is there. Now, after some time there will be no new tweets in my timeline, so how do I get the new tweets? So that's where this command here shows up at the end of a timeline. I can uh, just double left click just a little bit to the right of that command and run it, and it goes off and loads the new tweets. In the future, there will be a T user command where you could go look at some information about that user, uh, follow them, unfollow them, those kind of things, and maybe look at their timeline. But for now, this is what I have. All right, thanks for watching.